at sana bukas magawa ko ng maayos itong challenge na to kasi matigal ko ng gusto to and hindi ko alam kung gusto rin ako nito <laughs> so yun see you tomorrow mga guys guys um, today's morning and We'll start this English challenge now. I started late because I slept late, so now I'm going to cook rice because that's my first choice. And since there are no dishes to be washed, I'm just going to cook rice. Yeah, so follow me. So I'm just going to put all this old rice. To this plate so that it will not be wasted so I'll just update you if I'm started to prepare the rest if we're going to cook so so guys I'm done with putting all the old rice into the plate I'm into the bowl now I'm going to wash them I will going to wash this pot so that um, So that we can start cooking. I'm going to wash this pot so that we could just, yeah, start cooking. So now I washed the pot and it's here. It's all clean up. Now I'm going to the toilet because I need to pee. <laughs> so I'll update you if I'm done and I'm done going to the toilet and I'm done putting the rice. I'm gonna cook six or five I think because we have so many old rice there so I'm going to cook six or five yeah. so hi guys so <coughs> the time is 4 p.m. and um, I actually went home from the hospital for my orthopedic appointment so some people may know this that I'm not vlogging my hospital appointments, my doctor appointments because I don't actually like to show all of my life, all of my things or lifey things. I don't know what to call it, but I don't like to show them. So I'm not vlogging everything and it's my privacy so I hope you respect that but anyway I'm here to show you all of my hip splinters <clears throat> hip, hip splinters are like dressings they're used to um, they're used to what they're used to make your bones secure because I uh, um, I'm also taking medicines for my seizures and because of that my bones became really fragile and yeah and bone fragility is a cause and here are my splinters so these splinters are really like tissue or no it's not tissue paper it's like sheets of paper but they're more they're more um they're more night they're nicer than sheets of paper they are stronger so if you open this thing i 
don't have to open this thing, but... Yeah, so this is my splinter. It's inside. I'm not going to get it because um, it took the time yet to put in my hips. But later I can put on my hips for um, changing my splinter. Because every six hours, I'm changing my splinter. So I just changed my splinter at the hospital at um, 1 p.m. And I'm going to change again on 7 p.m. So I can show you how do I change my splinter. It's very easy though. I don't need to I don't need to I don't need to call other people for assistance so Yeah. Um see you later on 7 p.m. and I'm going to change my splinter and yeah. The time is 7.26 p.m. and today uh, what, what? And now this time I'm going to show you how do I put my new splinter because like I told earlier, like I said earlier, I'm going to show you how I put my new splinter because I'm changing my splinter every six hours so yeah come with me so I'm going to show you how do I put on my new splinter so magical lip again splinter is a very important part of the knee. So, I'm going to put on my new splinter. So, this is my new splinter. Now, it has a clip, and I'm going to put it on my hips like this. So, this splinter is really great if you if your hips are quite deformed so I'm going to put my splinter like this in this top part of the splinter there are two clips the one side from the left and the right side I'm going to put it around wrap it like a gauze pad like that under my clothes and then there it is my new splinter it's done so guys <laughs> i had just finished my shower and um today i um, mean tonight is i think it's we're getting to the end of our vlog and yeah i can't show you my shower routine of course it's my privacy and then um well i think some of you may ask how would you shower if you have a splinter on your hip just the answer for that question is my splinters are super thick and they really fit really well on your skin so you don't have to worry about getting wet because they will actually are super sticky just don't uh, apply soap onto it and it will not take off and well for the last few days um, when I first broke my hip bone I think I uh, after I showered, I just changed my splinter, but the doctor said that it's good to change your splinter for 6 hours so that you can't have any risk of infections. So, 
and my hip bones are giving me so much pain but I can get through it because I know that um, it's part of the life you have to feel pain not all of your life is joy and happiness you also have to feel and experience pain so that's it um, so here's where I'm going to sleep in this sofa I'm just going to grab my pillow and yeah and um, the others will sleep inside the room I don't want to sleep inside the bedroom because at night time they're turning the air conditioner and I don't want to do that I don't want air conditioning unit uh, what? <laughs> I don't want an air conditioning machines because they're cold so I'm just sleeping here outside so yeah thanks for watching this video and I think I succeeded though I failed you're the one who can judge okay you're up to it you can judge if you think I failed or I succeeded to do this English speaking for a day challenge so good night guys See you to our next vlog and again it's me Juliana Marchife from Juliana Marchife vlog and music covers in three, two, one, signing out. Oh but before that please click your like, comment, share, subscribe and click your notification bell for more updates of our new videos. Ring your bell beside the subscribe button and then you'll be updated. Goodbye guys. Mm-hmm.